and good morning it's Dan so in this video I want to talk to you about how people are going through a kind of a repair mode right now welcome to the Daniel Latto podcast show fresh content covering business investing marketing money health and more hey it's Dan hope you're well today just on the way to CrossFit it's really really foggy today um, I say it's really, really foggy. It's foggy for Spain. Do you know what I mean? It's like, it's not foggy. Um, so, um, I want to talk about, uh, this morning, about being in a state of repair. And uh, this comes about because I saw a post um, from someone and they're putting on about some of the challenges that they've got, uh, or that they've had. And they actually went insolvent. Their business went bust very struggling to make ends meet and they were kind of wondering whether they should be here or not like on the planet and uh, you know it's always a shame when you see that obviously and um, reading that obviously it bothers me because I don't want anybody to feel like that even though I've also felt like that at various times in my life as well I'm sure you have and you know the, the mental well-being situation that we find ourselves in is so much easier to talk about I still think there's a stigma there but it's so much easier to, to, to kind of talk about and admit and you know men in particular have, have issues around this um, about you know being honest and talking and all of that kind of thing but, but and, and this isn't about that specifically it's not about uh, suicide or mental well-being it's actually about when we consider what's happened over the last well, we're 2024 now, so over the last eight years, 2016, I think, was it 16, we announced Brexit, what a fuck up that is, what an absolute mess, a devastation of people's livelihoods. Uh, the best thing I saw about that was uh, people who can't read trying to burn down the library, like 100% agree with that. And then we've had pandemic, uh, no furlough for a lot of small business owners, zero help, zero furlough. Uh, we had to go out and get loans to survive uh, and then all these other people on 80% of their salary or whatever it was, 70% whatever, you know, just sitting at home for a fucking year, it's just ridiculous so we didn't get any help and and then we got massive inflation, then we got Ukraine, then we got interest rate rises and these massive tax bills due to section 24 if you're in property like it's just been one thing after another after another after another and please let the aliens come and just take over the world and enslave us all we'll all feel much better once that actually happens so until that happens it's like okay you know some people have really gone through the mill you know and it's shit there's no easy way i can't i can't sugarcoat it in any way it's just really hard and it's kind of like this idea that you know what it's about you taking one step after the other and putting one foot forward after the other for example right now we're finding it incredibly challenging closing business like like if business was a butthole it's puckered up <laughs> that's the best analogy i've got for it this morning it's just fucking hard it's just really really hard uh closing business and i think the whole of the uk is just like it's shut down it's just shut down. It just doesn't want to close any business. It doesn't want to buy anything. Everybody's nervous. No one can afford anything anyway. And so it's just really, really hard work. Uh, but the key to this is one step in front of the other. And if you can keep going, putting one step in front of the other, through the good days, through the bad days, then that is the thing that's going to get you through this. One step after the other. Uh, we're just at CrossFit and uh, I'm going to finish it on there but I'll probably finish this podcast a little bit later and talk more in depth anyway look I hope you find that useful if you've got anything to say please pop it in the uh, comment section I would love to hear from you all right we'll speak to you soon have a good one take care